This is Dave Ward, and we're back at the game. We're here at the Dunes at Maui Lani. I just ran into somebody that I wanted to chat with because I think we got a very special story and a very special person to introduce to you. This is Cassie Isagawa. Did I get that right? Yes. <laughs> Close enough. Cassie won the Junior US PGA Championship at Fort Worth, Indiana, when? Um, this past week. This past week. So she now is an official rock star on the island of Maui. With winning this championship, she also now gets an exemption at the U.S. Junior Ryder Cup this year, yes. which is unbelievable. When we're talking about a golf tournament, not just on in the county of Maui, just not on the state of Hawaii, but we're talking the whole United States. I mean, people have to qualify for this thing. And Cassie won it all, and she just didn't win it. She won it in a playoff. So we're gonna talk a little bit about the golf tournament and all that, but I wanna know a little bit about you personally because you know I've never met a rock star. Um, well, I'm from Wailuku, Maui. Um, I'm 16 years old. I attend HP Baldwin High School. And actually for college, I ver just verbally committed to University of Oregon on a full ride scholarship. You got a full ride scholarship and you're what, you're just a junior? I'm going to be a senior. Well, still, I mean, got a full ride already. What if you play terrible between now and then? <laughs> well, I didn't sign, so um, it could go both ways, but. That's awesome, that's incredible. Thank you. I mean, your parents must be incredibly proud of you. Mm -hmm. They're very proud, um, I mean. They I buy see. you a new car? No. <laughs> Come on, mom and dad. I mean, we're talking about the junior US PGA champion. She's 16 years old, buy her a car for God's sake. <laughs> How's that? Uh, maybe they might know. <laughs> okay, we'll put a little bit of pressure on the parents. So talk to us about going back there did you have any expectation of winning i mean it was a huge field back there a lot of great golfers all across the united states i mean what were you thinking what were you thinking going back there well i didn't think i'd get that far but um you know i just told myself it's one of the last tournaments of the summer and i've been doing pretty good in the beginning of the summer so i just told myself you know have fun it's it's going to be a great experience you know do the best you can out there and that's all you can ask for. So what did you shoot the last day to qualify for the playoff and how many rounds of golf did you play? Um, it's originally four rounds. They make a cut after three rounds, but um, the second day was canceled due to um, rain and thunderstorms. But uh, I, lost, I shot 69, so three under the final day in order to get into the playoff. I mean, were you just playing out of your head, or is this what you normally do when you play over here? No, it's, um, I was just trying to play the best I can. You mean, I mean, I just um, took, it took all my energy to just shoot a 69 out there. That course is probably one of the hardest courses I've played. Um, Sycamore Hills Golf Club, great golf course. I mean, I loved it. Were your parents back there with you to watch that special moment? Yes, both parents were there with me. Um, I was very happy they were there. Actually, after I made the putt on the final hole of the playoff, I went to my mom and she was crying and she made me cry and we, you know, I just hugged my parents and they just told me a good job. Geez, I feel like I want to cry right now. <laughs> so, where is the U.S. Junior Ryder Cup being, hand, being held this year? It will be held in Scotland on Glen Eagles Golf Course. So we will be playing against Europe. How many on the team? Six boys and six girls. Do you know your uh, playing partners now? No, I only know who, well, I know who my teammates will be, but I don't right, know right. exactly who I would be playing with. Excellent, excellent. And when is, uh, when is that tournament going to be played? I don't know the exact date, but I know I'm leaving around August, I mean, October 20th, excuse me. Okay, so we got to stay tuned for that because we oh, got actually, one. actually, September, September, so next oh, well, month. Get, I mean, please <laughs> get the date right so you don't wake up and go, oh, geez, I thought it was October. <laughs> Oops, it's September. My bad. This is a t just a chance of a lifetime, right? Yes, it's, everyone's been telling me it's gonna be a great experience and especially 
a week after that, um, we would be we're gonna have a chance to actually watch the actual Riders Cup. So. Oh my God. So here you 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 see it. You're learning about it as we speak. This is Annika Sorenstam, Lorena Ochoa, Michelle Wee, and now Cassie. I mean, you caught it here first. Let's follow this lady and support her the rest of the way out. Just unbelievable congratulations and good luck in college. Thank you. And uh, don't drink in college like I did. It'll ruin your game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you.